with Adam Hickton. Last weekend we went to see Adam Hickton in his studio. He's an illustrator. He lives in Bristol with his dog. He loves to draw wizards and witches. We asked him a couple of questions. What toys do you like to collect? I have a collection of these wooden carved toys. I think the official term is a noggin, uh, but they're also referred to as gonks. I like them because they're strange. Some of my collection look like they've been designed, but most of them look like they've been made by somebody's mum. Uh, the eyes are painted on by hand. The expressions are mostly vacant or pretty goofy. Some of them are missing hands or weapons. Most of them have fuzzy features and uh, furry faces. How long have you been drawing? I started drawing as a very young child, um, drawing hats, dinosaurs, ghosts, Father Christmas. Then I had quite a long break and then I started drawing again a few years ago. What do you like to draw? These days I like drawing wizards, elves, children, mushrooms, trees, cats, hair, yetis, fairies, flowers, hippies, bats and squirrels. Thanks Adam, we love your drawings. Hope to see you soon. Bye. A day in the life of Mr. Bumblechooks. Mr. Bumblechooks is a worm. He lives in a hole with his brother. Every day he goes out for a ride in his red car and passes a huge oak tree that his great-great-great-grandfather planted when he was a child. He then collects mud to put in his lunchbox. Sometimes he pies mud from the mud operative. He finds it quite tasty. The one in Wormco is not as good. After a spot of lunch, he goes to work. He is a doctor for Mudlarks Football Club, which is the local football team. Today they were playing their big rivals, the Owlers. In the first half there were no injuries at all, but in the second half there were three. Thompson, Gary and Simon got knocked down by the Owlers who were getting frustrated if they were losing the game. Two of them ended up with a black eye and one with a flattened head. But the final score was Mudlarks 3, Owlers 1. <laughs> After a long day at work, Mr. Bumblechucks goes back to the mud operative to grab dinner. He usually gets himself a little treat for dessert, something like a maggot cheesecake. Today he is going home happy because his team won the match. He greets his brother who is just back from work too. His brother is a scientist who spends his day in a secret tree laboratory. No one really knows what he's up to. It's for the military, so he's not allowed to say. Together they have dinner, and after watching Mud Factor, the singing TV programme, they go to bed ready to do the same tomorrow. The end. Draw me something with Mogu Takahashi.
Last weekend, we went to the Tring Museum, a museum just for stuffed animals. They have all the animals you can possibly think of. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hello. Even polar bears, wolves, and wild bears. There is a huge collection of zebras. I love this museum, and I definitely come back. It's a little bit crazy, but great fun. See you soon. Bye. Thank you for watching Anorak TV. Bye bye.